If you were to ask me who would win in the fist fight, Corsair Virtuoso or Lucid Sounds LS35X, I would say, well, gee, man, I don't know. But for now, I figured I would compare the two side by side based on their features, performance, and sound quality. Now, you're probably thinking, why compare the two at all? One is meant for PlayStation and PC, and the other is meant for Xbox. But it's free real estate. To start, both headsets' typical retail price falls at around 179 US dollars. But with both these headsets at the same price margin, which is going to be the best for you? When it comes to packaging, Corsair did not hold back. The entire time you're unboxing this thing, it feels like you're unboxing royalty, and a presentation is pretty much on point. Out of the box, we get a detachable boom mic and a very high quality fine braided 3.5 millimeter cable, and then we get a USB Type C cable, and of course, the headset itself. The Virtuoso has a very sturdy build. Its machine aluminum and pleather construction definitely make it one of the more sturdy headsets I've seen. Now, both ear cups feature a dynamic RGB Corsair logo, which is fully customizable through Corsair's IQ app. I didn't do that just because it was something I didn't care about personally, but it is still kind of cool that it's an added option in there. Now, one feature that Corsair added with this headset that I really like is that it's got an auto sleep and wake function, which basically when you put this thing down, after a certain time, it's gonna shut off and it's not gonna drain that battery. So if you're the type that has to stop your gaming every two seconds to go to the bathroom, you can put this thing down down and not have to worry about the battery of life being drained while you're doing your thing on the porcelain throne. All right, so the next thing I'm going to mention isn't really a feature, but it is something that is pretty cool about this headset, and that is that this headset will actually talk to you. What? Yes, that's right. It speaks, and the first time I heard it, it definitely caught me off guard. Now, if you're expecting this thing to speak to you like Cortana did that one time in Halo 4, I've waited so long to do that. You'll be disappointed because it's only two phrases. Mic on. Mic off. This headset has pretty freaking great sound quality and when 7.1 surround sound is enabled it really provides an immersive experience to the user. Did you hear that all your Pornhub watchers? Now be aware the Virtuoso is only wirelessly compatible with all last and next gen PlayStation consoles and with PC so if you plan on using this thing on Xbox, Switch, or mobile you'll have to use the 3.5 millimeter cable which came with it but be aware that you will not receive the full sound experience this headset offers if you use a 3.5 millimeter connection. Moving on to the LS35X, Lucid Sound didn't quite go as all out as Corsair did with the packaging. We get this big cardboard fitting to protect the headset while it's in the box, and that's really about it. Out of the box, we get a detachable mic, a cap for the mic port, a pretty standard 3.5 millimeter cable, and a very short micro USB cable for charging the headset. And then there's obviously the headset itself. The LS35X has an aluminum and pleather build just like the Virtuoso, but it's not as solid and sturdy. Also, we don't get a whole lot of rotation on the ear cups like we do with the Virtuoso. But where the LS35X lacks in packaging and sturdiness, it definitely makes up for in features. Lucid Sound wanted to make things convenient, so with the LS35X, you can rotate the outer ring located on both ear cups to adjust game or party chat volume and mute game or party chat by pressing LS logo found on both ear cups. The LS35X has another feature which may or may not have snuck up on some people as it did with me. It has a built-in mic just above the boom mic on the left ear cup. This is a feature I definitely wish I knew about immediately because there were times me and my wife both would just unplug the boom mic thinking that no one can hear us yell or <laughs> do other things. When you have a feature like having a built-in mic, having a separate boom mic now just kind of seems effed up. And if you're no longer going to use that boom mic like me and my wife, then you can now use that little plug they gave us in the box to seal that slot for all eternity. The LS35X uses Bluetooth to connect to all last and next-gen Xbox consoles and also the PC and mobile. If you want to use this mic on the Switch and PlayStation, you're going to need to utilize the 3.5mm cable that came with it. Now a cool thing about after syncing this headset to your Xbox is that when the console is off, you can actually power on your Xbox by turning on the headset, similar to how the Xbox controller works. Now I'm sure you guys are eager to know what the mic quality sounds like on both these headsets. So I'm going to go through the mic on the Corsair Virtuoso and then we're going to check out the two mics on the LS35X. Here's the mic quality on the Corsair Virtuosos. Here's the quality of the boom mic on the LS35Xs. Here's the quality of the built-in mic on the LS35Xs. Here's the Virtuoso one more time. LS35X boom mic and the LS35X built-in mic. 
The quality of the boom mics on both these headsets is very similar, but I think the Virtuoso is just a little bit more clear. So in my book, the Virtuoso is going to win as far as mic quality. Moving to the category of sound quality, I tested both of these headsets extensively to determine which one had the best sound quality. At the end of it, the LS35Xs had the best quality overall just because they could pick up on subtle details like light footsteps and the wind blowing. Where the Corsair, yes, it picked up those things too, but it wasn't as sensitive to them as the LS35Xs were. So sound quality definitely goes to the LS35X. Next up is build quality, and this one was actually pretty easy for me to decide. Because the Virtuoso is already solid metal, mostly throughout the headset, even under this leather. So build quality definitely goes to the Virtuoso for that one. Next up is comfort. So even though the Virtuoso has softer padding in the ear cups, because it's made mostly from metal, it's a lot heavier. So when you're wearing this thing for a long period of time, it really gets uncomfortable. The Lucid sounds are a lot lighter because they're not solid metal like the Virtuosos. So you can wear them for a long period of time and not have to feel like you take them off. As far as comfort goes, the LS35Xs definitely take that one. As I showed earlier, the LS35Xs are wirelessly compatible with more devices than the Virtuosos are. So automatically, this one's gonna get the point for compatibility. When it comes to features, both headsets have some pretty cool ones, but the LS35X definitely outnumbers the Corsair Virtuosos when it comes to features. When you think about practicality and convenience, LS35X definitely takes it with the uh, volume wheel and then the mute buttons on the side. The LS35X is actually gonna get another point because it had another hidden feature which I did not know about until almost finishing this video, and that is that you can actually swap out the ear pads very easily it literally just pops out and you can replace that with a different one you i think they come in different colors and you can buy new ones over at lucent sounds website so because of that this headset's going to gain another point the ls 35x was packing some street heat let me tell you man because it snuck up on me with that freaking built-in mic now the quality on that mic may not be the best but it was a feature that's it, it just adds to the value of it in my opinion I can't say my Xbox Live friends have the same opinion of the uh, built-in mic, but uh, <laughs> that's another story. But I guess overall we did come to a verdict. If there was ever a fist fight between the Corsair Virtuoso and the Lucid Sound LS35Xs, I think that if we're going street rules, the LS35X takes it just because it's got a little more features than what the Virtuoso has to offer, especially if you're primarily an Xbox gamer. Now, maybe if you primarily game on PlayStation, Corsair Virtuoso is probably going to be more of your thing, but if you play on Xbox and PC, then LS35X is definitely going to be your best bet for your money. If you want to help me decide on future content, you can do so by joining my Discord server. I made a channel just for video suggestions, so if you have any, you can go on there and drop them in there. I just made the server, literally just before posting this video, so it's brand spanking new. If you guys enjoyed this video, please consider smacking that like button until it disappears and also subscribe to the channel as it really helps me continue to make content for you guys. With that being said, thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.